Welcome to another video. Recently, Llama 3.1 was launched by Meta, and it's pretty cool. There are three models in this launch, the 8B, 70B, and 405B models. Today, I'll be telling you how you can run the 8B model locally and use it, and I'll also tell you how you can use the 8B, 70B, and 405B models for free if you don't want to host your own models locally. So, let's start with locally hosting the 8B model. First, go to alama.com. Click on the download button, choose your operating system, and download the setup file. Open it, and just follow the on-screen instructions. Once done, it should start in the background. Now, go to the Models page and click the Llama 3.1 model. Copy this command and open your terminal. Paste it in there. This will download the model and get it installed. Once the model has been installed, you'll see this chat interface on your terminal. Send a message and check if it works. Now, go to Docker. Download the Docker setup file. Follow the on-screen instructions and that will also get installed and start in the background as well. Now. Go to Google and search for Open Web UI. You'll find this GitHub repo. Click on it. Scroll down and you'll see this command. Copy it. Open the terminal and paste it. This will take some time to get installed. Just wait a bit. Once it has been installed, you can go to your browser and go to localhost at port 3000. Once you go there, you'll see this screen. Now, You'll need to create an account here. Just create an account with any credentials, as it's all local. Once done, you'll see this chat interface. At the top, you can see the models from Alama that you can use. Just select the Llama 3.1 model, and now you can start using it. You can send a message, and it can answer quite well. There are a bunch of other things that you can also do with this interface like you can create new threads, chat with documents, and a bunch of other stuff. You can even do calls and stuff, which is also kind of cool. Now, that's the local installation with the Llama 3.18B model. But, if you want to use the 70B or 8B models without messing around with local stuff, then you can get that configured as well via Grok. Grok is free for rate-limited API usage. So, basically, to get the interface configured with Grok, just go to Google and search for Grok Cloud. Register for an account. Go to the API Keys option and create an API key. Now, copy the API key. Go back to Open Web UI, and at the bottom left, you can see the profile icon. Click on it and go to the Connections tab. Enter this Grok base URL and enter the API key you just copied. Now click the Save button and then go back. Now, you'll see the Llama 3.18B and 70B models in the drop-down. Just select one and you can now start using it. Since Grok is very fast, you can get responses really fast. It's pretty cool. But what about the 405B model? Well, currently Grok doesn't support it. So for that, we can use Together AI. Together AI gives you a $25 free credit, so you can use that for free usage. To use it, just go to Google and search for Together AI. Now, get yourself signed up. Once you are signed up, you'll see this page. Now, go to the Settings page, and in the Billing tab, you'll be able to see the free credits. Now, go to the API Keys option and copy it. Now, go back to Open Web UI. And in the Connections tab, enter this Together AI API endpoint URL as well as your API key. Once done, save it. Now, you'll be able to see a bunch of models. But just select the Llama 3 405B model. And now you can also use the 405B model for free until the $25 free credit fades out. But overall, it's really great. You can use the 8B model locally for free. And if there's something that the smaller model can't do, then you can use Together 
AI's 405B or Groke's 70B model. It's pretty cool. There are a bunch of other things that you can also do with this interface. Overall, it's pretty great. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comments. If you liked this video, consider donating to my channel through the super thanks option below. Also, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you in the next video. Till then, bye.